Um, today I'm meeting up with the Cruz family to harvest guandu, or I think which is pigeon peas in English. But yeah, I'm meeting up with their family today, and we're gonna go harvest guandu on their finca, which is I think it's about an hour hike um, out of like the main part of my community. So let's go. by the bridge right here which passes up into the upriver part of my community which is about an hour walk from where I live and there I took pictures of flooding in the community to share a little bit more about my experience um, one of the expectations that I had was that for me to be successful, I needed to have like tons of people come to my trainings to help them, you know, work on their techniques for farming or just, um, trying to help them business wise and tips on how to run a better business. And well, there have been times when nobody has showed up to my meetings or anything and you know at first you know I felt like a failure but I'm not like the thing is I have to figure out I needed to figure out what exactly my community wanted I found that more of my experience is more about creating friendships with these people and they want to learn more about my culture as well passing by this is where people actually dig for gold in my community um, we do have some gold diggers I guess that's what you would call them gold diggers so this hole here is where someone was digging for gold to be an agriculture uh, business agent volunteer. I did go to school to study business and the closest thing that I ever got to farming was planting flowers with my mom. A lot of it is hands-on agriculture work and so I've definitely learned you know a lot of things about agriculture and I honestly love gardening and I would like to continue it when I do return to the States just because it feels really empowering uh, to grow your own food and just know where it comes from.
Last year, I went with my host family to Harvest Gwandu. It's about 30 minutes away from where I live. But this, um, where we went to today, it's about two hours away from my house or one hour away from my community. And I don't know, it's, it's just really beautiful to go with my farmers sometimes to their fincas just because the, the, the fincas are really far, but the... Just like the vistas, the sights, they're so beautiful, especially when you leave like early in the morning because they like to start early in the morning. Like they have like the fog and the hue clouds are just kind of like leaving the mountains. It's just, it's so beautiful to see the sunrise in the mornings. Mm -hmm. 